um, what was the reason for uh, for acquiring this vessel to do the, uh, the coldest journey? Well, we know that the Agullus, SA Agullus has worked in the Antarctic for many seasons before. So we knew she was a very capable ship. We knew that they had very experienced uh, officers and crew. So uh, that combined with the capacity of the ship, she has a very large crane, which we also needed. Uh, so it was a combination of, of the experience and, and the quality and performance of the ship. You also came at a time when South Africa has just, uh, you know, we, have a, we are a developing nation, even developing in terms of maritime. So how do you, do you see this as an advantage in terms of uh, how you proceed along the way? But it's, I mean, it's a huge advantage because I think the, the expedition that we're on is, is inspiring an awful lot of people, particularly young people. So what we're trying to do is to use that um, excitement of what we're doing to engage with young people and at the same time to be able to give a lot of young African um, boys and girls the, the opportunity to, to go to sea and perhaps go on to, to get a career in the maritime industry is, is tremendous. Uh, at least uh, almost all the cadets that are on board this, on this ship will be joining the expedition to the Antarctic. Have you, uh, how do you think that they would be able to cope with this kind of venture? It's, it's going to be a big adventure for all of them and uh, I think even now they probably don't quite realise what they're going into but the Antarctic is, a, is an amazing place and it inspires an awful lot of people so you know it's a huge opportunity for them. Could you tell me a little bit about uh, the kind of significance that TORT has uh, in terms of you know marine expeditions and this kind of expeditions in terms of historical uh, new achievements we want to make. Yeah, well, what, what we're attempting to do, which is to cross the Antarctic in the winter, uh, has never even been attempted before. So, you know, it's, it's, it's a big step forward in polar exploration and it, it's the last big polar journey. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> Pleasure. Thanks a lot. Yeah. Good. How do we find out more about this expedition and how can South Africans follow this on from now onwards? Okay, we've got a great website up and running, which is www.thecoldestjourney.org. And on there is a, a lot of information about the expedition, about the charity which we're supporting, which is Seeing is Believing, and about the educational uh, program that we've got running alongside it. Thank you very much. Yeah. I haven't though, no, just I, Cape I Town and Joburg. And it's a much more but it was better city and the yeah. weather's fantastic and yeah. all of those kind of things. Just you're not talking, that's possible. Thank you. Brian, talk about just talk anything. Yeah. Talk something. Yeah. I love Cape Town. Fantastic yeah. place. Just incredible people, great scenery, great food, lovely beaches.